Hello ladies! I am so beyond thankful that you guys agreed to partake in my Prosperity Acres caroling group this year. Let me level with you, Sally. Hmm? The only reason that I came here was because you gave my daughter Jessica a solo in the Fall Festival. Okay? She was my only option. Between your two daughters, she was the only one who didn't sound sort of like a... How do I put this? A French press machine? <laughs> Listen here, Betty Bible bitch. I'll have you know. Ladies, ladies, why are we arguing right before Christmas? Not very holly and jolly. <laughs> That's right, Ellen. And I believe we're all here. I think I've counted everybody. Well, that's odd. Debbie hasn't arrived yet. She said she would be here. Oi, I haven't heard from her all day. Last I heard, she had left a while ago. She said her stomach was acting up, so she's running a little late. Oh gee, that's rough. I know when I eat cheese dip, I am sent to the restroom immediately. <laughs> oh love, that, that's a bit TMI, yeah? We're here for Christmas carols, not shit Miss Carols. Honestly, I don't know why you guys expected Debbie to even make an appearance. You all know that bitch is flaky. Now, Nancy, you know that's not very spiritual. Her job is very hectic. She does what she can. And we all work jobs, Sally. That bitch is not special. Frankly, the only bitch who's flakier than her is Pam. I, for one, cannot believe the utter riffraff of you Neanderthals. Except for Susan. But shall we get started with decking the halls? Or should I deck Nancy? in her face. I mean, it would fix her bird nose after all. Oh, that's rich, bitch. Keep talking and you'll have way more than one silent night. <laughs> what <Well>, now? <laughs> Oi, we all made time to be here, yeah? So let's make the best of this. Christmas doesn't last all year, so this shall be quick. Christmas lasts all year long when you devote your life to Christ. Oh, give it a rest, would you? Honestly, Sally, your holier-than-thou act gets old very quickly. Do you hear what I hear? Sounds like the pop calling the kettle black. <laughs> Nancy could never handle the paradigm shift when her power is moved away from her scaly grip. Just because that archdemon has become the president of the HOA, she thinks she commands everything that breathes the gall. A real pity, in it. Uh, listen here, bitches. I'll have you all know that if it weren't for me, Prosperity Acres would be as trashy as Broke Valley. <sighs> Hardly. I say with Sally's wonderful lifting spirit that really helped us all during this time, while Camille Hawthorne, defense attorney, kept trouble off the streets. Yep. <laughs> Nancy is just a resident with a gold star sticker. <laughs> Uh-huh. And where the fuck is Camille Hawthorne, a defense attorney, at now? Hmm? She's not goddamn invisible. <gasps> Nancy, this is the season of Christ. Watch what words you say. Also, she told me beforehand that she had a major case to deal with this week. So that's why she's not here. What the retarier said. <sighs> but you should tame that beast inside of you. Haven't even begun singing. We've lost all the godliness in the air. God rest ye angry privilege, bitch! <laughs> I did not come here to be bashed. Sally, I swear- Now hold on a minute. Debbie still isn't here. Shall I text her? Maybe. I created a group chat that we can all discuss this in. She said that she had to stop at a pharmacy to relieve herself. <gasps> but she should definitely relieve her odor from her breath as well. Oh, God bless. So she's across the street then? No. Uh, oh, excuse me. But apparently she stopped at the pharmacy in Laketon. Laketon? Oh, heavens to Betsy. That is on the opposite side of the fucking state. What is she doing in Laketon? Did she take the exit for the inbred insult convention instead? Hmm? I reckon that's in a totally different county even. I guess we're just fucking clown central here. Let me go get my costume makeup. <laughs> The only clown I see is Pam. Has anyone else seen her makeup? <laughs> this is my holiday glaze. Mm-hmm. And you should rename it a holiday glaze. <laughs> Sad court jester. 
Ladies, I will not allow this session to become unholy because of raging emotions. Can we practice at least one song, please? Of course. <laughs> And what song would that be, darling? The first song I've selected for us to sing is Joy to the World. Oh, that song is one of my favorites. And of course, Pam singing it would be Simply Divine. Oh, did Pastor Richard choose that one? How did he know it's my favorite? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I chose the song and my husband just agreed on it. Well, I'm ready. I warmed up beforehand. <laughs> I'm always warmed up. That is how it earned me three Oscars, two Tonys, and an Emmy. <clears throat> yeah. We're not talking about your overused vagina, you burnt pancake. <laughs> oh, hooray! Let's start singing then. to the world the Lord has come let earth receive her king let every home prepare his room and heaven and nature sing and heaven and nature sing and heaven and heaven and nature sing joy, joy to, to the world, world. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this bitch. <laughs>